going on, peeps? Welcome back to the channel, and thanks for stopping by. And if you're looking for something to watch, Invincible is the joint. It is a dope show. Everybody likes different things, but give it a shot. I'm pretty sure you're going to like it. If you haven't been watching it, you've been missing out. So today, we're going to find out who is the immortal. The Immortal has been around for thousands of years. Most of his origin is unknown. Even he is unaware of his origins. Some type of accident occurred over 3,000 years ago that gave him superhuman abilities and immortality. He served King Arthur as Lancelot, was an explorer under the alias of Christopher Columbus, fought in the American Revolution, and even became President of the United States under the alias of Abraham Lincoln. He fought in World War I, and he finally became a superhero in the 1930s. The Immortal's abilities are numerous. He has accelerated healing, flight, a high level of invulnerability, superhuman endurance, superhuman strength, and superhuman speed. He also has immortality. As long as his head is not separated from his torso, he will stay alive. He also has the ability of resurrection. If his head is detached from his torso, he is only in a state of stasis. Once his head is reattached to his body, he will return. The Immortal does not age. The Immortal made his first appearance in Invincible number 7 in 2003. The Immortal is a human male whose true name is unknown. He stands 6 foot 4 and weighs 260 pounds. He's possibly the strongest pure human on earth. Having participated in numerous wars, he is a masterful tactician and strategist with real life experiences to call upon. He met Cecil Stedman and became a member of the Guardians of the Globe. He worked with the Guardians for a long period, helping to prevent numerous disasters. He was seemingly killed by Omni-Man like all the other members of the Guardians of the Globe. But due to his ability of resurrection, he was revived by the Mauler twins, who attempted to enslave him. He would later rejoin with the new Guardians of the Globe team, team up with Invincible to subdue Omni-Man, help take down the Lizard League with the Guardians, and assisted the Teen Team in fighting the Flaxons. He would later even assist his reformed nemesis, Omni-Man, and his Viltrumite people to defeat the Technicians. So what do you think about the Immortal? Are you watching the Invincible series? Let me know your thoughts down in the comments. As always, I appreciate you taking the time out of your busy day to stop by the channel and check out my videos. Please like, share, and subscribe. We'll see you again real soon. I'm gone. Peace.